Okay, everybody, it's me, I shoot you a girl. Good evening, good morning. Okay, you guys, let me bring you this quick deal that I did at Kmart. Now, I want to start this video off by saying your mouse may vary for the simple fact that I had points. So I started with points, and I only started with, I do believe, $30 and some change in points. If you have more in points at Kmart and Sears, this deal could be really good. Um, definitely, all of Kmarts definitely have wipes, and they have diapers but I did find this printer I went to actually two different Kmart's you guys each Kmart's a little different that's why I always like to say your mouse may vary because this printer might not be at a different Kmart so I'm, I'm just giving that little disclosure today I'm also going to show you guys that <clears throat> if you guys saw part one this Canon printer said $99. So I was going in there with uh, the um, idea of thinking, doing this deal that it was $99. I scanned it and it came up $70. So I had to tweak the deal. And usually when I do uh, videos like this, you guys, you might say, well, you already have the Huggies in your um, basket. Yeah, because I always scan, scan, scan. Whenever I'm interested in a deal before I even shoot a video, I make sure I scan this stuff first to see what it is. And if it comes up a great deal, then if I decide to do a video, then I'll drop a video. So I'm trying to take my business to the next level. And I definitely need a printer. You guys, I need a printer um, with everything that I do. Selling, garage sale, stockpile, Amazon, Poshmark, just everything. I need a printer. I don't have a personal printer. I've never had a printer. So I decided to invest in the type of person that I am. You know I don't pay full price for anything, you guys. I need a deal. I need to either roll a gift card, some points, something. I don't like to pay full price for anything. Anything that I do, I do not like to pay full price. All right, you guys. So with this deal... I spent only $57.92 out of pocket. I did, let me see if I say this right, three to four different uh, things to make this deal very small. So the first one was, I want to show you guys this. Now, I've said this on previous videos. Here is a gift card. And just to let you guys know, I did this deal at Kmart, but we know Sears and Kmart are under the same umbrella. So you can use Sears gift cards at Kmart, just in case no one knew that or if you were questioning that. So I went to my local Smiths, you guys. Right now, Smiths is doing points back. You know the deal. You buy points, and I think they even have a digital uh, download. Don't quote me on this, you guys. I didn't even check my receipt. <laughs> I know for sure right now when you buy a gift card, you get two times the points. So I kind of figured that I was going to spend $60 out of um, pocket today. So I put $60 on this Sears gift card and was going to use this at Sears. So I got two times the points. So with all the deals that I do, driving around, delivering, stockpile sales, garage sales, sidewalk sales, I do a lot of driving. So I like to use points from Smith's to get my gas lower out of pocket. So that was the first thing. The second thing, and actually I don't have it because obviously it's a digital download, you guys. I use one of my digital downloads. Now, everybody's account's going to be a little different. It's specified, you know, on how you spend. You know, they track you to see what you're spending, uh, what you like. So they send you different coupons. I had a coupon, a digital coupon, you guys, that was if you spend $100 in the store, you get $10 off automatically. So when I spent the $70 on this, I grabbed the Huggies to put me over the top. The Huggies cost, if I'm not mistaken, oh goodness, you guys, $24 if I'm not mistaken the wipes were $7.99 so that that gave me to my threshold of over a hundred dollars then I came in with a coupon I had a regular coupon you guys for the Huggies two dollars off there's also like I said everybody's account is a little bit different it's based on you know how you spend what they want to send you so I used a total if I'm not mistaken a gift card a download coupon when you spend a hundred dollars you get ten dollars back then I used a regular physical coupon and for some strange reason you guys when I looked at my receipt I must because when I do the the download the coupons I just download everything that's on my, my, my uh, little um, 
how do you say, account. Because you never know what you're going to go in for. I might go in for a printer, but then I end up getting Huggies. Now, if I wouldn't have downloaded the coupon, I wouldn't got the deal. So for some strange reason, it took an extra $5 off, you guys, my, um, my whole total. So with all the digital coupons, the regular coupons, the gift card, and I want to show you guys the kicker, you guys. It gave me back a coupon. <laughs> it gave me back this coupon, you guys. So when I spent, I spent, like I said, out of pocket $57.92. And I used my gift card, you guys. So I still have a little bit, a couple dollars left on this gift card, which is cool. It spit out this coupon, $7 off my next order thank you from huggy so that was cool i didn't have any intentions of buying diapers today because i just went in for a printer but i had coupons and to get me to the hundred dollars i went ahead and bought it and huggy spit out a coupon for seven dollars off my next order now you know i'm going to roll that into some kind of deal and pair it with something to get my out of pocket down or get something free basically i think i could take this coupon and get seven dollars worth of stuff for free because it says seven dollars off just saying and let's see excludes items prohibited by law so i would have to probably read it looks like it's pretty legit it doesn't say excluding like clearance or anything like that oh you would have to turn it i'm not going to read that for you guys but what like i said to maximize the deal, and this goes for Target, Walmart, Walgreens, Walmart, not so much Walmart because they don't give gift cards and points and stuff like that. Walgreens, Sears, Kmart. I always like to hit a deal, not once, not twice, but hopefully twice, three times, or four times because I like to use the digital coupons. I maybe like to use pair it with a paper coupon if, if possible. I also like to get a gift card, you guys. And the fourth one that I think I, I haven't said is points. If you have points, use your points to pay. Why would you pay cash? And then I never pay cash anyway because I go buy a gift card to give me points back on my gas. And you can use a gift card anywhere. If you go out to eat, and I've said this in a previous video, if you and your family love to eat at, um, I don't know, um, let's see, Friday's. And you go every Friday to eat at Friday's. Why wouldn't you get a gift card at Smith's and get two times the points, four times the points, and that will pay for your gas or get your gas out of pocket down and then use the gift card to pay. So everything that I do, I use a gift card. If I'm going to Best Buy, I'm going to go to Smith's and get a Best Buy card. Just everything I like to do, I like to get a gift card, you guys. It really helps out with gas, especially if you do a lot of traveling, um, which I do. I do a lot of deliveries, so it helps with my gas. So with that being said, you guys, you can use points. You could use gift cards. You can use coupons. And that's digital coupons and regular paper coupons. Always use as much as you can to maximize the deal. Now, like I said, because I'm going to try to keep this video under nine minutes, you guys, because you know I'm very long-winded. But always maximize a deal, especially if, um, you know, I had no intentions of buying the Huggies, but I went ahead and did that to get me to an, a higher threshold so I can get more money off. And then I start stacking coupons and whatnot with the deal. And you guys know me, the, the printer's mine. I'm going to use that for my personal use. But this right here, you already know what it is. Anybody have children? You know that's up for sale. <laughs> I have no children, so I can turn around and make profit on top of that, what I spent today. And I spent less than $60 for a hundred, and it says $100, maybe it was worth more, and that was one price. And then it got marked down again to $70, you guys. So I would just, to be on the safe side, I would say this is a $100 printer, definitely a $24 box of diapers and these Huggies wipes were $7.99 so but out of pocket I only spent $57 plus they hit me with the one-two punch and gave me a coupon from Huggies to spend more in the store which you know I definitely will all right you guys kind of a lengthy video I hope everybody's having an amazing night I'm going to bed because I'm tired but yeah definitely check your local Kmart's for printers, if you guys are looking for printers, definitely go online. I didn't go online. I just went directly into the store. And hopefully you can um, combine a deal, put a deal together. But remember, you guys, if you're going to go shopping there anyway, you might as well get a gift card from Smith's and get 
some gas points. I'm just saying. All right, you guys, you know the deal. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you don't like this video, that's fine. Give me a thumbs down. I hope it was very informative and tell a friend to subscribe. Have an amazing night, you guys.